You're about everything you, the story you know from everybody, the, you know, who got affected by it, uh, you know, things you saw on TV or things you read in the newspaper or in the, you know, magazine, and suddenly everything come back to you. Say, no, I'm one of these people, you know, no, I'm one of these people who have going to deal with that. That is renowned chef Jean Robert de Cavell talking about the fight of his life against cancer. His friends say he never missed a day on the job or a chance to give back. And this weekend, Jean Robert is being recognized for all of the ways he's always helping others. He's getting a Lifetime Achievement Award at the American Cancer Foundation Striders Ball. Jean Robert, my friend, is our guest this morning. We're also going to talk in a moment about how you can go on vacation with Jean Robert and his family. <laughs> yeah. So good I to hope see you. you. Be it. Nice to see you. You are dressed for the so Striders Ball. You got your derby stuff say, you know on. What? It's going to be a derby party. So yeah. I put my derby, my, my, my derby. Uh, <laughs> Uh, jacket, my derby tie, I and I'm it. ready for the party. It looks great. So this is your 25th year in Cincinnati, this and I know people yes. have talked mm -hmm. all year about that. Uh, what did you think when they told you, we're giving you a Lifetime Achievement Award, Jeremy? I'm not that old. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> you still have a lifetime to go, uh, that's right? That's exactly the way I felt. I'm not that old. <laughs> what a great honor, though. It is, you know, and it's, I don't know, it's high. You know, I, I think when you come to a city like Cincinnati and uh, being also some from a different country and, mm -hmm. you know, when things like that happen, you realize, you know, you did the right choice to stay. You did the right choice to be part of the community and uh, you did the right choice to put your heart and, and be friend with everybody and make the city better. And, and that's what exactly what I, you know, try to do every single day. I mean, uh, I try to um, offer some wonderful food and having a wonderful team together to be. but. In the end of the day, is really to be part of the community, and then, and I think it's it's what life is all about. Mm -hmm. You know, life is about yeah. making a, you know making a statement for you know like be part of the community. And I think when so receiving this this you know receiving this ach lifetime achievement, <laughs> it's a little bit you know it's a I I try to take it as very you know casually, but it's <laughs> it's very touching because yeah. it's like, and I'm intellectually worried for Saturday because I'm like, what am I going to say? I mean, what, you know. But I'm the other thing worry. about Saturday <laughs> is you get to sit back and be with your family and friends and just enjoy yourself. Just, I mean, uh, yeah. how often do you get to do that? Because uh, you're uh, always the one cooking and presenting. You and know, I don't even use one hand to tell you how many Saturday night I do that. So, right. you know, so. What's that so, going to be like? For, what's that mean <laughs> to you exactly, to be able to have that time? I don't know if I'm going to feel comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you won't. Maybe you know, I go back in the kitchen and yeah. Them. <laughs> I know that you started cooking when you were 16 the in day France. My birthday, yes. mm -hmm. um, and you call cooking a lifestyle. What yeah. do you mean by that, Jean Robert? It's a lifestyle. I mean, because you know, you you know, you 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 do something. You know, you create something or you do something for the pleasure of other. Mm -hmm. And then also, it's a part of a you know, you have different hours, and then to really the joy to translate what you to translate some emotions, some some feeling to, to foods. And I think food is everything. I mean, you know, if you think about it, <laughs> today in this social world, social media world when everybody's always busy and the thing was more important sometimes when you spend most time with your family, your friend, you, 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 you know, it's really like Slow down a long, and enjoy. A long food. Yeah. And I think so. It's a lifestyle because it's a, it's if you don't, you know, it's one of the jobs, it's a lifestyle for you too. Yeah. It's like, I think when you love what you do, it become it's a lifestyle. You it's not work. It's um, it's you enjoy doing it. You I work every Saturday night or most of the weekend. Um, well, I want to quickly mention the the cruise mm -hmm. next, July, next July. I know that there was a cruise <laughs> plan to raise money for the SIDS Foundation mm -hmm. and also for the American Cancer Society. Now, it's a trip to he Tahiti next July with Jean Robert and his wife Annette. Mm -hmm. And is Leticia going to? Leticia yeah, and Leticia. Part of it since it's in the summer. And you can actually go and be hosted by Jean Robert on this cruise. We have the information for you at local12.com. Just click the Get It Now links. And you know, I could talk to you all day. I've known Thank you 20 you, years. I just love you, nice to see you so dear. much. Nice to see Thank you. you for all you do You're very and welcome. for coming in again. <laughs> Thank you so Jean much Robert. for having me over. Thank you. <laughs> now here's Tara. I mean,